Hi everyone, in this video we will be taking a look at the Huawei A880BL Bluetooth earphones. So the A880BL is a sports earphones, a sport earphone which has Bluetooth 4 wireless connectivity. It has a retractable design and it's available for about $20 shipped which is, which is a good value considering the performance and features of this uh, earphones. Um, the A80BL has a retractable design and when not in use it will fold up to this shape like this and it has a stainless steel wire that can spring back so when, when you're using it it will be open up like this and the, the headband will be at the back of your head so um, the earpiece, the, the buttons are on the uh, right earpiece and over here there is a power button and here uh, at the bottom here is the uh, volume volume up and volume down button which also functions as the uh, the uh, track control uh, the positive one is for forward and this one is for backward so there is also a uh, rubber seal for the USB micro USB port which you use for charging the these headphones are market these earphones are marketed as a waterproof earphones and I believe they do quite a decent job uh, at waterproofing although I, I suspect some some sweat may have gone into the uh, the but the power button which I will explain later and the uh, it is also NFC compatible so you can just pair it by touching it to your phone so and it has uh, a set of three three sets of uh, different size earpieces I mean uh, earplugs here so they are quite comfortable although I feel that in the back of this the earpiece somewhere here tends to touch my ear earlobes which is a bit uncomfortable after probably about one hour of use and I, I tend to feel pain in the earlobe because of this part here touching my ears so uh, and the, the sound signature of the A80BL has a distinct V-shaped sound profile which means uh, it's quite punchy on the bass on the low frequencies and a bit low on the mid frequencies and high on the, the high frequencies so this is this type of audio profile is good for those those people who like the music with deep bass and uh, punchy audio. It's uh, it's it's not really for those who want a more neutral natural sound, a livelier sound, less V shape. So bear that in mind. Uh, bass bass on these earphones are quite uh, quite good. They are quite punchy, not too not overwhelmingly strong and uh, it does not spill over to the mid, mid frequencies and uh, for a pair of sports earphones they are quite good for the when it comes to audio so uh, it's available in uh, various colors I, I'm not sure I forgot what colors but there are a, uh, a number of colors for the headband uh, it has an all plastic construction on the body which is feels a bit cheap but still functional and I believe the the updated version of these earphones actually have a uh, what looks like fake aluminium casing I think I don't think they're made of aluminium but they do look look like real aluminium in the photos and yeah powering up is just as simple as this why is it okay there there goes uh, there are two LED lights, indicator lights, which uh, signifies that it's trying to pair via Bluetooth. Um, I've used these earphones for more than six months so far and they've been quite uh, not bad. Uh, I've used them for running in the gym and they've performed reasonably well. Uh, one thing I need to point out is that these plastic uh, buttons, they tend to rattle a little bit when I run but although it doesn't happen all the time sometimes it rattles sometimes it doesn't you, you can actually hear the rattling in your ear even when the music is playing and 
Another issue is the uh, the rocker the, the volume buttons are actually located in the opposite side from the power button. So sometimes when you're pressing the power button, you might accidentally press the uh, volume button, which is a bit annoying. So after a while, you you get you you tend to do, get used to it, and you you try to you, you try to avoid press the, pressing the lower button by holding the side like this. So overall, those are minor flaws actually. If you if you consider the value that these headphones give you for just over twenty dollars, and the audio performance is quite good for something that's over twenty dollars, and it's a Bluetooth compatible. Uh, as you can see, there are some glue stains up here. That's because my son actually ripped open the plastic. Uh, my three-year-old son ripped open the plastic, so I managed to glue it back. Uh, so far, it's still functioning okay. And um, yeah, this these are headphones that are they may not please uh, an audiophile, but for the average guy who works out in a gym or for sports and all that, it's actually quite impressive for the for what you get for the money. So I guess that's about it for my review of the Awe A eight eight zero BL earphones. Uh, I hope I've covered everything. These are currently my preferred choice of uh, sports earphones. I have the other Awe headphone which is does not have the band but this is actually more comfortable, more secure on your head. So I hope you've liked this review. If you've liked the video please uh, click like and uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Till then I'll see you again in another video. Goodbye.